Hello guys. Good evening. Hope everyone is doing very well. On this Sunday, beautiful weather. Welcome to Omar Sport Talk. Today is Barcelona's reaction. Today the day that we Kule fans have been waiting for has came and gone. And today I enjoyed what I saw. Barca played very good game today. We had the ball possession and game control under Valverde you always speculate because you never know any team that come to our yard usually challenge us yes Granada was a challenge but they didn't give us much trouble as they did in the past when they beat us 2 to 0 at their house and that has a lot to do with Barca losing possession of ball because Barcelona game style it depends on their ball control and able to press because the defensive and midfielders are vulnerable especially if they lose a ball in the middle of the field and if you have your defensive up you are vulnerable to a counter attack but today's game was very exciting and uh, at the moment of the game, you have this anxiousness and uh, just get mad because they were dominating the ball so much, but they were missing opportunities that are clear to them. Even though we know it's the beginning of a start with a new coach. Who's trying to? Uh, who's trying to put his play style on the on the game? Who's trying to change the team to pressure more to have more control of the ball? Because that's the kind of type of styling coach he is. He like to have the control of the ball, and we had that today. We played a good game. Sergio Busquets played very good. He was in Bonneville to a lot of the mistake that he usually used to make a lot. Today, he didn't have. Barcelona, usually when they play, they used to, have, they used to create a lot of fails. But today, none of that. They played their game. They were patient. At moments, it's frustrating, but they were patient. They wasn't rushing the passes. They had control of the game, and we had some couple of mistake. But uh, other than that, we still control the game. So. We had that one scary moment where Granada player hit the ball and it hit the pole. And at that moment, I'm like, oh my God, I hope, I hope that uh, that's a miss. And uh, that was a moment of relief because all that game position we have, we can't lose this game today. Madrid won. We cannot go 
for a loss today at this moment. And which again the man himself man did it again but all of majority of the players played a good game Griezmann played a good game the youngster Ansu Fati as well play, played a great game Jordi Alva we were creating plays on his side of the field so the midfielders wasn't so much vulnerable we're creating plays through Jordi Alva, Messi and Griezmann and Ansu Fati so that's a good sign that we know at least we're heading towards a good direction the changes was noticeable today and as a Kule, I'm happy. I'm happy today. It wasn't the score that I, I was looking for. And it wasn't the score that most of us thought it was going to be. We were going to beat Granada 3-0. But again, we're wrong because Granada tested us to the end. At the moment, we have moments of doubt. Where oh my, it's going to be a tie. Is it? Is it? But... uh. The coach made several changes that were key moment. And the key moment change that he made is bringing in the, the youngster, the youth player, Ricky Puch. That kid has a major talent and a major future in Barcelona. If they do it right. Because as soon as the kid came, he changed the game. Even though we were under 10 players on the field, but... He changed the game style. He has more rhythm on him. Ball influence went through him. The kid created play that were good. Yes, he lost a couple of the balls, but it's okay. It's part of learning. He's learning. He's a youngster. So he's learning, but if you give him more play time, he will take someone's place on the field. The kid has so much talent written on that kid. The fans, as soon as he went in, went crazy. Fan reaction, love that kid because he got that talent. We bring them colors first. He did his thing. But, you know, at that moment, the game is, was already 1-0. It's just he played his few minutes. So all of them... Messi played good, Alva played good, Vidal as always killing it in the field. I don't care what anybody say, but that kid has game. Anyone says that he's not Barca DNA, but he makes difference. He runs like nobody. So he played a good game. Out of the most people, Rakitic was slow. But his game was okay. But he he needs to either improve more or just he's gonna he's gonna be uh gone. Cause we can uh have that happen. But out of everything I'm looking forward to as game progress to see new changes to see new implements to see new style to see more aggression because we will be seeing that very soon so today game was a pass but we can do better we can go back to that style that everyone love and other people hate and we will get there because this is freaking Barca that's what we do so yep today good game more aggression is gonna be coming and the game is gonna get better better quality so thank you very much for the time and the patience 
and the way that we all been waiting for the game to come on Sunday. Thank you. And have a good night. See you guys next time. Love, peace, and unity. Yo.